Rome, 1600 AD. In Campo dei Fiori, there stands a pyre awaiting the condemned of the day. It is a distinguished individual, a heretic who, through his oratory, has earned three excommunications from Catholicism to Lutheranism, traversing Calvinism, daring to contradict the prevalent Aristotelian philosophy in Western thought, and offending the lofty conception of that very God whose vicars prepare to burn him. For years, Giordano Bruno had traversed Europe professing ideas deemed profane, and on the morning of February 17th, he stands before the crowd with a muzzle, a kind of gag, silencing his tongue so that he cannot voice his heresies. The guards strip him, drag him onto the stake and bind him. The crowd applauds, shouts, clamors. They desire the spectacle as much as the church desires the heretic's death. And thus, the bonfire ignites, flames envelop Bruno, and bring his earthly existence to a close.